Hello and welcome to the final episode of the Let's Play Victoria 2 in the Papa Name mod as the Ottoman Empire with Eastern Pirate. Last episode of the series, isn't that... Mm. Uh, excuse me, sad? It's very sad. International woman suffrage? Oh well. I mean, we, we, we gave women the right to vote, so um, don't yell at me. <laughs> Yeah. Let's see, oh, they're gonna annex them. Dastardly. Germany's becoming a Reich. Do, 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 go there and swing back. I think the Russians know that as soon as they peace out all their territories, like. Or their empire gets dismembered. I hope they know that. Even though in reality, even if they were at war, if this were real, they would have been dismembered by now, but... What... Ever. Not my problem. Now let's see, when does our, um... Casas Valley with Morocco looks like? 32 of April. Or April of 32. I'm gonna stop funding the Swedes and the Finns. I don't know, I wasn't funding the Finns. That's good. Who needs Finland anyway? Brilliant. Excellent. No. How would we ever apologize to those coke munches? To Oran. And I guess. Yeah, no, so I guess that's the. Um, well, whatever. I doubt our financial responsibility really. Like, I think we could lower taxes all the way, and it literally would not affect. We would not need to lower how much we spend for the rest of the game. Like, six years. Actually, no, we might. Eh. Let's see. I mean, actually, no, let's keep our let's lower the taxes to 20 and 20. Persia. Add sphere. <laughs> I'm assuming they're going to want a 10 hour workday. Over. Some arts endowments. <coughs> ah. That would be awesome if we could get our population up to, to 200 million before the end of the game, but I don't think we are. That'd be, oh, we'd have to conquer, like, entire, <laughs> we'd have to conquer a massive swath of territory to do that. Massive swaths of territory, which we just don't have the time to take. <laughs> Come on, Algeria, just surrender. You don't need to live. I think it also will probably fabricate on Italy to take, to take Sicily and Co. But do we really need Sicily and Co? I don't think we really need it. One more major war that I feel like fighting. <laughs> yeah, honestly though. But in, but in China, they just went to fucking shit, so. It's always, I always subsidize. Always, oh, they want to become my puppet. As the hell? No. Oh, fuck. My light just went out and off and on again. That's weird. And uncomfortable. Jesus, Russia, finish that effing war. Ooh, doo, doo, boom, 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 boom. 
The Ottomans are the master of the Islamic world. I like it. The Manchus are communists. Alright, there you go. Let's see. Bayang's the presidential dictatorship. Communists. There's a lot of communists in Kuomintang factions. Why did I say that like a fucking like Brooklyn person? Factions. It's a bunch of factions. Oh god, that was a brutal battle. Rock them in my cradle. In the cradle, rock them in a cradle. Neoclassical theory has been completed, market determined. Exchange rates, wonderful, okay. Can this war end? Okay, the Russians are winning it. That's, that's good. Why is Dalmatia on it? The Italian rest. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Morocco just kind of just kind of breezing through. So my school is having a senior cut day tomorrow and um obviously I'm not gonna upload this for the day I have recorded it. It's a December 14th is our uh, a greatly thought out cut day by one of our amazing class council members, you know, incompetent fuck. But I'm not going because, you know, I'm going to save all my days for when I can go to the beach in the summer. And, like, not have to freeze my ass. Like, I mean, it's going to be nice out tomorrow, but... Like, what can't I go to the beach or anything? The water's gonna be freezing. Ugh, there's rebels against Algeria. <sighs> Already, I have to save their bitch asses. Boy. Uh, I guess we know we're gonna just have to station an army there. To Algiers. And beyond. Okay, how are the Russians losing it? In battles, even though they're like occupying half the place? Like how they have like most of Sweden under occupation. Yeah, look. How would Russia get your crap together? Like, what the fuck? Just I'm actually going to go cry in a hole. We don't ever get to dismantle the Russians. Because of their stupid, stupid, incessant need to war. Put down, put that down quickly. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, we, did we get gas attacked? I don't know. <laughs> Do 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 do
All right, get rid of these fucking idiots and go back to Algiers. Algeria. Ooh. It really could be in one of our spheres, but is there really a point to sphering it? Let's do it anyway. Let's sphere the Italians. I mean, even if we lose them, it's not like there's only like basically there's only four years left in the game, like. It would not be that depressing to happen. If, or I mean, if we did 1.2 million? Damn! It's a lot of dough. No, okay, we still can't. Still can't. Russia! Holy shit! Finish this war. Like, Jesus Christ. Celebration of freedom. I swear, this is literally just two bunch of retarded boxers hitting each other. They have 78 brigades compared to 36. Like, <sighs> Jesus. <laughs> I just want that war to end. Is that too much to fucking ask? Halim Bey has died. How depressing. I'm actually about to go like fucking just in and go in as Russians and be like, yep, war's over, sorry, you suck. Alright, oh, yeah, I guess I'll go fun Sweden again. Sweden and Finland. Because the Russians are clearly incompetent in every form of the word. Keynesian economics. Diplomacy. Why would you... This is what I hate. The AI like breaks alliances and they're like, oh, why'd you leave me? They're a civilized nation. They're not a secondary power. They're a civilized nation. Mm hmm. So many Algerian rebels. I hate it. I think they think that if the people rebel enough, I'll somehow leave. Little do they know. I don't care about the lives of my men. And we'll fight till the fucking end. You're damn right, Morocco becomes a puppet of the Ottoman Empire. Alright, go station yourselves at Fez. Fezan. Egyptian Desert. Zambia. 32% Turkish. How about that? Ottoman Azerbaijan. <laughs> the Ottomans are the masters of North Africa. Forward. And they say there's no leftist bias in the media. Those right as scoundrels might. Number first. Of 61, so there's only like three years left, really. So it has canal dividends. Mm, excuse me. I fucking hate these rebels. They're causing me a lot of pain. Not even pain, the annoyance. They're hurting my heart. Let's see, 170. How's the war between the Russians going? 
they're still losing. Not entirely false, we should deport our unions. Now be our work days. And that war is finally fucking ended. Jesus. Where's our dismantling of an empire? We won a war to dismantle an empire. Oh, I can't fucking get our treaty. I'm gonna fucking get it. Oh, it's because I think it goes at fire at month change. Or not. There we go. Treaty of Moscow. Holy F and Louia. Look at all these fucks. Look at how badly Russia just got like dismantled. Oh lord, it's beautiful, 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 beautiful. Mm, Armenia. We could just puppet you. Yeah, I was gonna puppet them. Justify, I'll make a puppet out of them. Oh, it's v sexy, v sexy. All these Istans, all these Istans, and I can't even influence one of them. Yes, we will attend. So after we're done influencing Italy, we're gonna influence the shit out of all these Istans. Even though, oh my God, some of them are primitives. Boy, snowbird. Why is Kazakhstan a primitive nation? Okay, they're civilized. I don't know why I said they're primitive. I said they were primitive like two seconds ago, so don't yell at me if it didn't. Brilliant. <laughs> oh, we have rebels. The World Series begins in Belgium. And then, didn't that like organize during the war? <laughs> oh. Poland's free, Belarus is free, so much freedom. Kamchatka, the Manchus, <clears throat> oh the Russians suck, how are they even great powers? Belarus has rescinded voting rights, oh lord. Um, Italy, Atosphere. Okay. Let's see, I'm gonna get Kazakhstan. Let's see, why do they like us so much? Because we're a neighboring sphere member, the relations, and our score relative to theirs. We'll soon we'll be milking the resources of Central Asia. Which, okay, we can add a puppet on Armenia. Which look to be, ooh, very nice. So we got some oil and stuff. Moy sexy. Moy moy sexy. Wait, neighboring sphere member. Oh, Kiva, that's who it is. Good old Kiva. No, gonna, no not, not there. I don't want anything there. Let's see, Greece. Just to play a war, make a puppet out of them? No. Oh, maybe later. Um, uh, take puppet. Out of Trans Caucasia. All right, Armenia, let's a duel to the death. Smells like popcorn in my house. What the fuck do you got going? Fascist dictatorship. How about that? Boy, those Russians. They really suck at life. They're all with Greece. Hmm. Maybe because they both suck. Get it? Because they literally suck at life. Oh, why is Transcaucasia in here? What you trying to do, boy? Trying to take my shit. Now it's gonna go by even higher because of our better relations.
We gotta make puppet against Transcaucasia. The Ukraine, Belarus. The Russians kept Konigsberg for some reason. That's weird. Oh, they joined Poland. They're at war with. Well, we have we had a rebellion. Uh, I'm not sure you guys can take them out, but uh, should try. Do <laughs> your best, kids. I don't want you to hurt yourselves. That's those big bad rebels. Jesus, what were they thinking? <laughs> mm. And now let's go for some culture experimental psychology. Trans Caucasia. We're at war. The result of oh, an election going on. Oh boy. Holy effing shit, Algeria. I hate you so much. That is a wartime election. You should cry about it. Boo-doo-doo-doom. -doo 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 I'm just gonna click, click random things because let's face it, the conservatives are probably gonna kick dick in. It's just a cringy way to think about winning something, but it's true, they're gonna basically kick everyone's dick in. Do 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 psychoanalysis. Hold support the campaign. Hold hot today. <laughs> Series. There were times where we weren't even a secondary power, and now we are top fucking dog. What is Argent? I don't. I don't, mind. I don't even know why I'm so allied to you. <laughs> yeah. Doesn't really make sense. But uh, yeah, no, now we're top dog by a lot. Algeria and Morocco? We said to you to hunt rebels. Will you hunt rebels? Or is it only our rebels that you hunt? I think it's only our rebels that you hunt. Clearly it's only our rebels that you hunt. <laughs> and then to Kapan. That's rubbish. Armenia will become a puppet of the Ottoman Empire. Now I want you guys to just go take Tbilisi. Okay, Hungary, I will ally with you. Again, I don't know why you unallied me to begin with, but okay. I, I, I really, I think it'd be really cool. If, like, I mean, I don't think we we're going to have enough time, but if we could get all these guys into our sphere, that'd be pretty awesome. But I don't think we're going to have time. So, whatever. The liberation of Transcaucasia. Um, yeah, I mean, if we could drag them to another war over, we could drag them to another war over it, oh well. We can wreck the Persians. I mean, or we could just give it to them, I don't really, it really wouldn't hurt my feelings. Our athletes are victorious, they always are. I've never once gone, your athletes suck dick. Get out. <laughs> the Polish liberation of a breast. Psychoanalysis has been completed. Behaviorism. 
must be renovated. Let them have full citizenship. Ooh. Yeah, I don't. I guess they're just really popular. I don't know what it is, but these guys consistently destroy in elections. Like they're not even fair. <laughs> Excuse me. What that was me. I was like, let's say like what? I don't think I got that. Jesus, is Morocco really sinking that fucking bad? Fez has been taken. Jesus Christ. That's what happens when I don't pay attention. Fucking Moroccans. And then that's probably Kazakhstan. We are now have the Kazakhs in our influence. Say little Confederacy would be next. Nation without another continent. Oh, how about that? I don't know where me and Kazakhstan are on the same continent. Come on, liberate Fez. Liberate it. Good, 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 good. Ottoman Georgia. Make it so. No, they better not be as troublesome as fucking North Africa. These guys are a real pain in the dick. Rashidis. Um, I'm gonna put you on like hunt rebels because you know it's kind of do that well. Also, I don't. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Number two. Who in the fuck took our spot? How did they? Oh boy, snowbird. Whoop their butts. I guess they just got lots of prestige, those damned Americans. Uh, Alexandria and Courage Craftsman. Yeah, no, they definitely just got like a crap ton of like prestige from like some war, and that's why they're oh, Armenia. Oh, my God, disband troops. Go there and then back to there. Actually, no, you can just go chill in cars if you want. Can we hold ourselves in cars and go there? Adar Aradahan. Oh yeah, so we're back at number one. I don't know, their military score went up real quick for some reason. Hyorala <laughs> Bay has died. Hyorala. Moroccans thought they could get past me. No their dirty Moroccan tricks. Too bad I'm um, super fucking great. I'm like the Middle Eastern Britain. Assume too many allies. Yeah, go station yourself with Fez. <laughs> This is a twisted world we live in, but a world that nonetheless we have shaped and cast our image upon, I to say in some sort of philosophical fashion.
<laughs> you know, we have a lot of Sphere members. We're, I think we have more than the Americans and only second to the British. And the British, we have India. So, whatever. Factories. Produce faster. Mm -hmm. X. Yeah, sure. Museum of Natural History would be would be amazing. Why is Japan trying to influence my Central Asian countries? Shouldn't you be like, trying to like take over the world or something? Why are the Russians fighting the Koreans? What the? I mean, <laughs> what the fuck? Belarus is just getting like fucked up the butt. What the hell did the Belarusians do to everyone? Like if we, I'm sure if oh, the communists control the coast. Oh, clutch. So that's canal. Um, there's really no one posing a specific social. There's really no one posing. Uh, can they like merge? That'd be seems to be interesting to see if they could like merge. Who knows? Alsatania. Belarus is just hated. I don't know. I don't know why. Romania's always been harsh. Who are the hell? Silesia? What are they? Oh, they they have their democracy. Oh, democracy, democracy, democracy. Who in the fucking Algeria? Oh, it's nothing they can't handle. The Italians are also in my sphere. We are the masters of the. I think no, they're out with the Russians though. So uh, yeah, I don't really feel like fighting the Russians, even though they're a piece of shit and suck on every level. They have like no military. Fucking tar tar Tartarstan is a place. Kali Kamika Mika Mika Mika. That was not a place either. No, Rush, I will never in my life back you. I will back Kamiyako. A fuck are you, well, and a fuck are you, Dauphine. Oh, it failed in listen. International. Oh, that was like instant. Sailor Confederacy, or Confederation, whatever you want to call it. Friendly, we can still wear them though, that's very true. Realism. We're discovering these all super late. But who cares? We are the number one power in the world. And who's gonna stop us? No one, that's the answer. Wait, Silesia's in our <laughs> sphere of influence? Since when? I mean, I'm not gonna complain, but... Since when? That's weird. That's very weird. Why did I pause? I don't know. I didn't know I did that either. Colonial Sorencia. Boom, boom. Oh, it's like majority of Libya's Turkish. There's strong Turkish minorities across Africa, actually. The there's a part of Zimbabwe has a strong Turkish minority. There's uh, oh, I don't see if there's any like other weird minorities. <laughs> Iraq has become majority Turkish, I'd say. Truly, tis. Morocco and Armenia. Oh boy. I feel like this has just turned into deal with your puppet's problems simulator. Like, and sign up for that crap. Holy shite. They do got a lot of problems.
what is that white army is a psych nope 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 we can't we're not competent enough to rule why can't I just annex my puppets things would be so much easier they're in the pretend terrains indeed pretend foreign investment Australia boom 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 Algeria doesn't have any like, industry to speak of. <laughs> Let's see if we can get Hungary to at least a hundred, not to a hundred thousand, to five hundred thousand. <laughs> Can this game just hurry the F up? I'm getting quite to the board. I mean, we're almost, we only have one year left. So we'll be fine. We can sim through it. The Ossetania, the Netherlands. Okay, math culture and add in the avant garde. I don't know why anyone would like go out of their way to research these. Like, I think you'd only research in a few like a competent placeholder. Okay, I guess at least he's competent. Can't argue with the competent. Placeholder that you cannot. That I cannot. Who are the British at war with? Because they're clearly at war with someone. Oh, they're at war with Germany. That's sad. The two former great allies have fallen to bickering. Good thing they don't call me either of me and they don't try to call me in. Because I don't want to fight either of them. Actually, I ally with the British. They would not accept because too many alliances. Well, I'm ally with the Germans, but I don't, I don't. I wouldn't join them. Not against the British. Not the British. They, in the harrowing hours of those civ of the war, well, yeah, no, they're just kind of fighting it on my territory. I'm not really sure if I'm okay with that, but. I, I also really just don't care. <laughs> Say, Lord Confederation can now be added to our sphere. I don't know why I just did that. That was probably very waste of timing. Boom, 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 our sphere is now extended into Turkmenistan. I think that's is modern day Sinai. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Hundred and eighty million people just waiting. Why are you at war? With, why is why is Crimea? It's, yeah, there's some of them losing. Okay, Germany, you do you. So apparently, somehow, two Crimean brigades are, um, you know, defeating the the Ukrainians. Oh, they're run they want to fight in Algiers. All right, march on Algiers, douchebag. Fuck you up. You know, so was that a good idea? You're kind of losing like 5,000 people a day. Compared to my like, 2, 41, my fault, 19. I feel like this episode has been like 30 minutes long.
or 40 minutes long, but we're all, we're basically done. So, yeah. If we look around the world, I'm sure we'll see, we see a very different place than we would have seen, than what we would have predicted at the beginning of the game. Our sphere's great. Our power unmatched. And Lunda is kind of sitting there still, uncivilized, somehow. Even though they're sandwiched between two very civilized nations. And then this is kind of unclaimed part of the world. Hey, the Portuguese I guess, just don't like it. <laughs> the Japanese Belgian success. China's in chaos. The communists fighting the nationalists. You think they would join the nationalist faction, but apparently not. Apparently that is not of interest to Transcaucasia. Oh no. Go put down these hooligans. <laughs> the conservatives won fair and square. I was unaware there was an election going on. So it always still fast, so I guess they finally found a stable government after all those years of chaos. The Germans are also conservative. We have conservatives in power. And we've had them for the majority of our time. Same with the Americans, the UK, the Germans, the French, the Japs. Everyone top of the top guys is a conservative power. I think it says something that uh, the Republicans nowadays are obviously superior than the Democrats, those dirty liberals. Uh, they can handle those. Uh, Bukhara increase to cordial. Even though I don't know why I'm still doing that, it's not going to change anything. <laughs> they should get a work to immediately. Why are the Germans and the French, not, not the Germans, why do the Germans and the British have to fight? It's not that big a deal, man. The Chinese, the communists, versus the nationalists. I said that in opposite, backwards order. On purpose. Just kidding. It was not on purpose. Why would I ever do something like that on purpose? Oh, they are democracy too, and they have fascists. I guess they. Romania has elected fascists. They've elected conservatives. They're just slabophile reactionaries. Oh no, it's conservatives, but they were reactionary. Conservatives. Ah. Uh, we've researched everything except some naval crap. We can research fire control systems up here our navy, I guess. Naval plans. This is all so rudimentary. <laughs> it's like taking us two days to research. Oh, that took didn't take long. That didn't take long. Homo ne near Aulus. Ottomans attacked in Italy. It's unfortunate indeed, but I don't really give a crap. Um, a whistle stop tour. And I guess the Arab revolt just never gonna end. Cause they're a bunch of queers. So in the closing months of our game, let's just take one last look at our population. 55% farmers, we have 1.83 million Ottoman Turk soldiers, we are 73.6% Sunni, we are 23% Turk. Oh, we have, we have, we have French. Ew, we have a French minority. It's gross. It's really gross. I'm not even going to bother with that anymore. <laughs> we have accepted cultures of Bulgarian, Albanian, Bosniak, Greek, and Romanian.
our population for the end of the game will probably be 182, 185 million, somewhere within that range. Algeria can handle it themselves. Just kidding, I will help. I really wish there was a competent, like, Hearts of Iron 3 converter, but there isn't. The one that is there is kind of all over the place and doesn't really, it does not work at all. I would not recommend it. It's very shitty. If you do convert it, you have to convert it yourself. I frankly don't know how to do that, but if you do, if you know how to do that, you're, you're a cool kid. But I, I have no clue how to do that, especially converting like armies and stuff. Like how in the hell would you go about doing that? Like I guess you could like, write down the exact numbers and divide that up amongst brigades and stuff. Do brigades, divisions, and shite. But that'd be so much work. So much work. So here we are in our last month. We see our glorious empire, which the sun never actually. I think it technically would set. Eh, actually, maybe not. I think we might have. Yeah, no, it would never set because we own Caribbean islands as the Ottoman Empire, and 21% of them being Turkish on this specific island. <laughs> well, yes, the sun never sets on our empire. Uh, we have a good amount of allies. For some reason, we're still allied to Cuba. Our spheres, wonderful upon interaction. Sure, do what you want. And that's the game, kid. Monitors, quit. Woo, we finally finished. So we are number one. The United Kingdom is in number two. The U then it's the USA, Germany, France, Japan, Canada, Belgium. Followed by our good ally Hungary, Norway, Australia, Mysore, Sweden, Occitania, Italy, Hyderabad. 55, we already went over this stuff. Ideology, 40% of our population was conservative, 9 socialists to da 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 da. All that. And then we go if we look at the ledger. There were still, there's only two uncivilized nations, Lunda and Macron. And they were, didn't have the lowest score. And they, I guess they, they were partially westernized. That's weird. The UK had the largest, because they were mobilized. Industrial score was the United States by a lot. Prestige was us. Um, total population, the United Kingdom had the largest, then the Chinese, then us. So if you, I don't actually, never mind. Um, we had the most provinces, we had the most, second most factories, we almost had the most by two. Um, they had 100% literacy, that's actually, pretty good. But these are all countries that started with relatively high literacy, except for Japan, I think. So we did we did good for ourselves. Leadership, we had the most leaders, brigades, we had the most we had the that, and then we 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 didn't really gonna have a navy. Um there's a lot of absolute monarchies in this world still. There's a lot of democracies, there's a lot of fascism, a lot of his majesty's governments, a lot of president there's not as much communism. There's some Prussian constitutionalism, political reforms. I think there's oppression still. There's slavery in a lot of countries still. Holy shit. Um, social reforms. Uh, there's a lot of public guys. Country comparison. Who had the most slaves? God damn it, Korea. The UK had that. Germans have the most capitalists, provinces, we don't need to look at that. So thank you guys for watching this series, if you've watched the whole series. Thank you, um, I don't know what I'm going to do next, probably some Sid Meier's Beyond Earth, I have the Rising Tide DLC, so that'll be fun. Thank you guys for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, message me about any suggestions for games that you might want to play. I have EU4, I can do, I don't, I mean, I could do another Victoria 2 one, I don't really want to do Democracy 3. Uh, what else do I have? Crusader Kings, but I'm not really a big fan of that because I, I also don't have that much of the DLC. I also have Civ 5, so message me if you have any suggestions. But thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.